glassing, the grinding, the glassing, the grinding, the grinding, the grinding. But we were not able to finish it until now. That finishing involved flow coat. It's the final layer and is rolled on nice and thick. It gives a much more polished look. And there's really now only one thing left to do before this boat is ready for fit up and for its Yamaha to go on the back of it. And that's to clean up this sort of bit of mess here where the deck meets the hull. It's been a bit of an issue for us the whole way through. The deck's now painted, it looks good. The hull, it's going to be wrapped. We'll get to that later. So that's all going to look good. But what we need to do is join them together. We're doing that by fitting a nice looking aluminium bump bra, which, yep, not only looks nice, but will also hold the boat together. This is Nick Berg from Channel Fiberglass, mate. Um, have you ever seen anything as pretty as the Haynes Hunter Tri Hunter 170? I've actually never seen one before, <laughs> to tell you the truth. It's, it's a common reaction that I get. Uh, very popular boat, well ahead of its time back in the day. Three hulls, you know? Yeah. Gonna be like driving around on air. No, Magic I'm carpet. Thinking, wasn't they, when they put these together? <laughs> <laughs> um, mate, you have fly coated the boat for me. What does fly coat do? Well, basically, flow coat will seal off your timber. Yes. Um, it's got a waxed surface in it, so it sort of just protects anything that you've basically glassed up. It looks good too. Yeah. It sort of finishes it. Finishes it off. And, mate, now uh, the bump strip going on, you've glassed in the console for me. Yep. It's getting close, isn't it? Very close now, yeah. Yeah. Well, well I'll just let you um, tear it out. We've got a couple of corner caps to make for Yeah, you. just a bit more prettying it up. Yeah. So another day or so, then I'll come back and pick it up. You can have it in a couple of days for sure. You're a good man. <laughs> Thank you, Nick. You're a good man. I'm excited. <laughs> You have been very quiet on the subject of money. This is Project Boats on a Budget, so where are you at? Well, boat and trailer cost five grand. Michael's mentoring program set me back 9,000, spray painting 1,500, and maybe another grand to flow coat, etc. That's got $17,000 all up, about half of what you've spent, and it's exciting times because now we'll see rapid progress.